Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. I am going to be filming a morning in the life. It's a Wednesday today and I get Wednesday mornings off work. So I'm going to bring you to the yard with me, show you everything I do this morning with Cyril and Eli. Also, I'm going to set up a fun jumping exercise and do that on Cyril. So I will talk you through that exercise and hopefully you'll find it useful and can do it on your horse. I'm going to try and do regular sort of jumping exercises on this channel, so stay tuned for that. But yeah, I hope you enjoy this morning in the life vlog. Can I just say today is the first day I've worn a jumper. I'm still in denial that winter's coming. I've been out in my t-shirt and my short sleeved shirts every day, but it's getting a little bit chilly now. So I've actually gone all out and put a jumper on which I'm actually very grateful for because it's pretty nippy out today. My boys are still on their summer routine, so I'm trying to eke it out a little bit longer. And it's actually gonna be dry for a couple of weeks now, which is really nice, so. Also, I went to the shop yesterday and bought the ponies a horse lick. This is for Cyril, and then he's got a green one in his stable, which Eli is gonna have. And then, what else did we get? CD granola lick from Lick It and a couple more lickets in here because the boys love these actually Eli's never had them so I bought him one to see what he thinks of it because also when they come in in a couple of weeks time overnight they're just bored and buses really just to stop them getting too bored and to give them something to do in the stable these ones are really good because they last till ages whereas those ones here literally in about three seconds it just bites the whole thing and then it's gone whereas this he actually ekes out a little bit more so that's good and this one is for a healthy digestive system. So that is always good. So I'm just about to get the boys in. So all food's ready. This is his new horse lick. So we'll see if he likes that. And then Eli's. He has, he has his little treat bowl for when he comes in. And then he's got Cyril's chewed up one. I know this isn't the safest packaging. That's the only thing I don't like about these. But you can't actually get it out. So I can't even transfer it unless I actually get covered. Which I still don't think is doable. Anyway, so here's Cyril's half-chewed one. But we'll see if Eli likes that. That is for... Oh my God, look at the front of that, Cyril. Um, That's for a spirit tree. Are you coming, Cyril? Come on. You're going for a ride. You've been out all night. Good boys. Do you want your treat? Here you go. One for you. That's it. The next one is for your brother. You can't have both. Here's yours. Good boy. Nice and mucky. On you. Oh, very nice and mucky. Right, let's put your head collars on. Wind swept. What's that hair doing? Eli has a drink in here every morning, don't you? Just before the gate where you come in. <laughs> Hello. I think he likes it. Nice. You seem to have some friends in here, Eli.
Here is me basically throwing my tack on the floor. So first off I jumped on Cyril and as usual warmed him up properly. I did a bit of walk, trot and canter and a bit of pole work, lateral work and then I also did a couple of flying changes in canter over the poles like here. Which Cyril actually hasn't done that much of but he sort of knew how to do it anyway so that's handy. He does sometimes do flying changes anyway even without me asking him so that's good. And then on to the good stuff. This is me just practicing over a couple of the jumps and then I sort of link them together so what you'll see is there is three jumps all in the row in the middle of the arena and it's sort of an S shape over the jumps so it's sort of a really good jumping exercise to get your horse turning, thinking, listening, not speeding off after the jumps or before the jumps because then you've quickly got to turn before the next jump comes up and it also allows them to sometimes take them on an angle if you want them to so it teaches them to sort of jump jumps on the angle and then you can also rather than always doing the S I've also got a couple of little jumps there which we do as well a couple of fillers but rather than always doing the S you can then join the jumps on a circle and change the rein over them so your horse doesn't know which way he's going so you might think he's doing the S but then you're not, you're doing a circle, so it's really good to say that they're listening to the rider. It was a very good boy, Cyril. Wasn't you? It was a very good boy. Excuse the helmet hair, but Cyril. Uh, <coughs> excuse the helmet hair, but Cyril always gets a stud muffin after he's been ridden, don't you? He loves his stud muffins. And Eli, what are you up to? Oh, he's munching his hay. But he has been playing with your licket, haven't you? Love it. Show everyone your chops. Show everyone your chops. That's proof. That's proof. You got it on your chops. Are you going to get it all up my arm? Or do you think you've got more treats on offer? Not anymore. I'm going to look like I've been in some sort of fight. So, my boys are all done for the morning, and I am now off to go walk my doggies and then an afternoon of work. So thank you so much for watching this day in the life video or morning in the life. And if you like it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. I'm going to be filming a winter morning. I don't think Cyril wants me to go. He's trying to swallow my keys. I'm going to be filming a winter morning routine soon when they're swapped around in a couple of weeks time. So you'll get a full in-depth morning thingy. What else do you want to chew now? Gloves? <laughs>